This is the Abacus CVP03 thermostatic shower valve. This particular one is a two-way diverter. It comes in a one-way, it uh, also comes with a three-way with a third handle. Uh, the thermostatic is on the bottom, thermostatic control with a 38 degree stop. I'm going to talk to you about the serviceability and maintenance of the valve. Uh, typically these need servicing and looking at every year to two years depending on the lime scale in the area. Generally there's no issues with the diverter. Very, very rarely you might get a tiny bit of passing water which happens sporadically. This can be uh, rectified by taking out the cartridge and cleaning it, checking the seals, worst case replacing it with a new one. A potential issue with the thermostatic handle is the grub screw isn't fully tightened on, then the handle will become disaligned. In conjunction sometimes with the uh, lime scale from the shower head, that can cause the cartridge to stiffen up. And especially so then this really does need to be tightened properly because if you force it because it's been stiff then the temperature isn't aligned properly with the hot and cold and so it won't be stopping properly at 38 degrees. This is the brass body of the valve. There's four components in here, two check valves, two cartridges, high quality vernier cartridges. If you've got any debris in the system, it causes issues. Obviously the lime scale causes issues as well. So I'd recommend taking all these four components out, flushing the system, cleaning them in a lime scale remover and reassembling. As you take the thermostatic components apart, it may be worth taking a picture. There's a mark on here for the alignment, which is for the calibration of the cartridge. Taking these two off gets you to the check valves, which are removable. Now you're left with a full brass body once you take these components out. Following the lime scale remover instructions, I'm going to now clean the, the components. Now see that this is perfectly clean and moves really freely. We're now going to reassemble the valve. Before you put all the components back into the brass body, you need to flush the system and get all the debris out of there. Now everything's cleaned and flush out, we're going to spray everything with silicon grease and put everything back together. Check that all the seals are aligned and everything is now tightened up. We've now reassembled the valve, everything's tightened up correctly. We're going to ensure the thermostatic cartridge is lined up correctly with the collar and ideally you need to be testing this with a thermostatic probe to get your 38 degrees once you reassemble and put the handle back on.
making sure that this is tightened really well. So that's the shower valve put back together, all service running smoothly. All the serviceable components can be ordered from the Abacus website, following the link below. Thank you for watching.